Hello everyone, Green Gemini here, back with your next episode of Satisfactory. Okay, so you know, we've gone through, we've done a lot of fun stuff so far, right? Uh, last episode, I think we went through and got the framework taken care of, and there was a little bit of an issue that I noticed, um, that, I don't know if you guys have, have said it yet or not, because I'm actually recording this, um, right after, well, not right after, but before, before this, the, the previous episode went out. Um, so you'll notice something a little different up here. And I also want to touch on this right here as well. So let me go... Can I get up on top of this smelter? Yes, okay. So we set this up last episode, okay? So basically what we're doing is we're getting the iron ingot merged into here, split from here to over here, and then we're splitting it again to go into there main reason for that is when you look at this one this one only needs well this one needs 15 per minute and that is what we're doing i think well yeah because it's going in there pretty well it's 84 percent i may have done some of the math wrong on this um but no 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 no. that is what we're doing so we have 30 coming out of here and 30 coming out of here which is merging into 60 and then splitting into 30, and then splitting into 15, okay? So that is why that is set up like that. And then it's merging the other 15 back into here, so it's actually creating 45 for this one, which is all coming in together here for this. I don't know, it, it works out, it does, it works out. Um, wait, are these set at 100%? Yeah, they are. Okay, anyway. So that's working out. We've got... Oh, got a little bit of an issue with iron here. Hmm. Interesting. Well, we also have an issue with coal, but we'll, we'll fix that here in a little while. <laughs> okay, anyway. So the mistake that I made was these. Um, we had 60 per minute coming in and 60 coming out. Uh, and then I had that going into one constructor for 12 pipes or 12 beams, I mean. Well, my math was wrong. I looked at the wrong thing for the beams. So the beams for our versatile framework are actually 30 per minute, not 12. I, I was seeing 12 and thought 12 per minute, but it's not, it's 30 per minute. So that's when I went in and adjusted that, and now we're doing what we're supposed to be doing, but we're having issues with, um, production of materials so we have to go back through and look at some of this stuff uh, I'm not gonna do that right now um, I just wanted to let you know that I'm aware of the issue and I will address it later uh, we already have a hundred two hundred six and we need 500 so we're almost halfway there already um, and the reason why that's already ramped up a little bit is because I've been spending a lot of time in here walking around, looking at things, trying to figure out what to do next, and also figuring out what to do next, and then adding some pillars on here, some, some what, are, what are these things called? Um, these stack uh, stackable conveyor poles, adding those on there. Um, so I've been doing that. Uh, but what I want to focus on today, and what we need to, to complete, is we need to complete Tier 4. I want to be completely 100% done with Tier 4 today. And then from there, we will move on to the next step. Uh, in order to get to Tier 5, we have to have... We already have these 500 building, and then we need 100 automated wire. Okay, That's what's going to be set up next. Uh, the production rate is going to be 2.5 per minute, but with the way we're going to set it up, we're actually going to be doing 5 per minute. And that'll be in the next episode. Um, and it's just the way everything works out with how we're getting it. Um, the advantage that we're going to have and why we need to get the Tier 4 stuff done is that in Tier 4, we have the Logistics MK3, which gives us the conveyor belt that goes 270 resources per minute, and the conveyor lift as well. Now, I believe somewhere in Tier 5, it gives us the MK Miner 3, I think, 
but until we get that we're just gonna have to overclock our miners because we need more coal like seriously seriously need a lot more coal right now because it's, it's not enough on that line and I thought it was gonna be but it's not so anyway um, if we're looking at this I need just seven more of those do I have the stuff? Oh, yes. I definitely have the stuff on me. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Okay. Uh, steel pipes. I'm just going to go ahead and craft what I have on me. Oh, okay. Three to two. All right. Um, obviously, I'm not going to get rid of all of that. So that's fine. And this is why we're creating stuff over and putting it here. Oh, oh, and the other thing that I put in, the other thing, I put a little, <laughs> I put a little walkway in because it was a pain in the butt trying to get up there uh, to grab all the stuff. So what I did was I dropped items on top of here so that I could see what's in what bin. So I know I need pipes, so we're gonna go to this one. Give me two, yeah, give me three because I feel like I'm gonna need those. And this is, see, this is just going to go by super, super fast to get this done. Um, so what are we working on right now? Hypertubes? Okay, so hypertubes, done. Bam. Lovely. Yay! We can finally get around to some places easier. Pipe-based personal transport. Okay. Yeah, because you can harm yourself pretty badly when it comes to that kind of stuff. Um, so we're going to go ahead and select the milestone for this. We actually have um, everything we need. Except for a little bit of a uh, little bit of this, need a little bit of concrete. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's go with eight of them, so we can have a little extra on us. Um, and believe it or not, we can actually complete this right away. Yes, awesome. <laughs> okay. So done. So these take the beams, which we now have 100% full storage unit on. Um, stackable pipeline supports are good. Actually, the stackable pipeline support will help us with water and getting more in there for our power supply. Uh, we have, let's see, organization. We're able to build larger storage containers if we need to, which I'm not sure what we would need to build larger ones for yet. Uh, fluid buffers those we've had um, so that's good but we haven't upgraded anything else okay oh right so transportation hypertubes stackable hypertube hypertube support hypertube entrance and hypertube itself so it takes copper sheet and steel pipe Okay, so this is where we need the encased industrial beam things. Uh, so we're going to need to make... Ooh, we're going to need some more of those. Three, four. And here's my plan. So we're going to do this. We're going to get the automated wire set up next episode. And then from there, uh, we're going to need to get the industrial cased beams set up uh, we're also going to need to get ooh, give me more of these one two three uh, copper sheet I'm going to need some of that two three uh, what else am I going to need I have concrete iron plates I think I've got enough of um, I think I'm good yeah yeah I think I'm good rods plenty of okay I think I've got plenty of stuff I think I've got plenty of materials. Um, we're also going to need to look at motors, statters, um, to all of that other fun stuff that we're going to need, right? And some of that stuff we're going to have to create off in the distance and, and belt it in. Um, 
which won't be bad because we basically have a network already set up to belt stuff into here. And then we've got uh, two storage bins down here ready to roll. Um, and then we can expand our storage out this way if we absolutely have to, to about right here. Um, and then obviously we're not going to be able to go that way anymore. We're going to have to go that way. But I think we've got enough storage bins to kind of keep us going for a little while. Um, so let's get a hypertube built, shall we? <laughs> That's what I want to do. Now, question is, do I want, where do I want the hypertube to start? First of all, um, let's go with that and that. I haven't done anything with transportation yet. Like, it says this is all new, and I haven't looked at any of it. I don't like the jump pads. I don't, I just, mostly because I can't handle them. I, or, well, it's not that I can't handle them. I, I don't know how to work them. Um, all right. So, I think we'll start it here. Or maybe we'll start it here. Yeah. Because that's kind of... Well, the hub is there. So if our hub is here, then I'd say then we start it... Ooh, that does... No. Uh, let's go... Five? Or was that... That was six? Oh. Okay, let's go five... Why is this not matching? Let's go there. Hmm. Probably because we have, yeah, it's a one that needs to go under there. Yeah. Which, that's fine. That works. Okay. So anyway, enough of that. Um, so we're going to start with the entrance. And actually, we're going to start with a shortcut here. Go one, two, three, four. And then we're going to put power in here at 5, 6. Okay. So then HyperTube, we will enter in. Let's go 3 with our support. And the support will go right here. Put an entrance onto it here. I'm going to need more beams the industrial encased industrial beam not just the regular beam it has to be a special one uh what does it take to make those five i think so let's do a couple well let's do 15 so that'll give us a total of four that we can make uh okay um let's see we're gonna need to connect that to electricity so give me a power pole right next to it Okay, that to there, and then that to there. All right, so from here, I want to take another one. We'll do a support, and this is how I'm going to do this. And this is why, this is why I have these stacked up like this. Um, now, once we get out of the base itself, we're not going to be able to do that. But I should be able to take that into there with very little... Ooh. Never mind. I was hoping that was going to work, but it didn't. So I'm going to have to hook that up to there. That will go down into here. Okay, and then that can stretch into there. And this is... Seriously, this is like one of the best ways I have found to get a hyper tube built. Is by following along this <laughs> it's just the spacing is fine um, you don't have to I mean for me you don't have to worry about doing too much or too little when it comes to placing this down pull it back one go there to there and then we'll take that one there and then this is what's going to make us go fast. It's <laughs> going downhill like that. Now, going uphill, on the other hand, that's another story. Now, here, unfortunately, is where we stopped uh, with putting it on top of these things, um, which I would like to redo those to where we can bump it up a level. Um, but in the meantime, we're just going to have to take this and make do. 
So we'll just go to the other side of it and... Oh, wait, 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 wait. If I go like this and before I select it going down, I need to turn it that way. Okay. So then I can go like that. And then here's where we can keep it into a straight line. Which of course, it will tell me if I get too far. Ah, oh, shoot. Give me, come on. Come this way. And then you'll go this way. Where are we at here? So that needs to go to where I'd say probably here. Then we need to be mindful of that copper because we're going to need that. So let's take that. Do I want to go up and over this? Or do I just want to say no? See, of course, that's right in the middle. There's more room on that side. So why don't I do this? Let's, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, take that and go here but up with it. Is that as high up as we can go? Looks like it. Without doing a support, probably. And pipe is too short. Right. Um, so let's try and do, I don't know, I'm doing something different here is what I'm doing. Um, the stackable hypertube, what if, can I put down stackable conveyor pole first? Can I put down two of those and then put, yes, and then put that on top of it. That's great. That's absolutely great. I love that. Okay, and then I should be able to take that and then hook it into there. Come on, I need to get to the other side here. Thank you. Oh, oh, wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. If I can do that, well, that just changes everything. Hold on. Hold on. No, 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 no. I, I, mm -mm. no, 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 no. No, no, no. Here's what we're doing. Here's what we're doing. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Okay, you're going, you're going, you're going. <laughs> um, oh my god, this is awesome. Okay, okay, okay. I'm really excited about this. You're going to love this. We're going to go and put it on top of here. That's what we're going to do. Um, so from here, right? So from this point, this is totally great. So we're going to go... That's going to go like this. We're going to go up, up, point up. Okay. And then that is going to be for um, the other stuff. For the, uh, uh, what is it? What, I'm, what, what am I trying to say? That's going to be for the copper coming through. Okay. Now I'm hoping this does not interfere with that copper line that's going to be coming down there but that's, this is awesome oh my god okay that can go there oh yes oh we are totally doing this hang on hang on hang on can i can i just get up here there we go ah i fell down oh, i fell down um all right that 
Sometimes you can't tell really if you're if you're actually selecting it or not. Let's see, I can't get through there. I have to jump around it. This is perfect. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm actually just gonna let's put this on there. Put this on there. Um I have an extra one on there for some reason. Nope, that needs to go to the other side. See, this is this is pretty hard to do. This is not easy. All right, a little bit of a computer glitch, but that's okay. We're back. We've got that there. And then we've got that to go onto there. And then I think the rest of the way here... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that is for... That's for the start of this. And I think we need to go ahead and have... Let's go logistics. That can go to seven. I think we'll add that one on there too. And then we can add this one on. Oh gosh, please tell me I'm going to have enough of this. So there's four. That one can go there. That one can go there. <laughs> this is awesome. I'm really excited about this. I am. I'm super, super excited about this. I can go there. I hope you guys are too. Because this is going to be great when it's done. Have that go to there and there. I thought I hooked that up from there to there. I guess not. Um, hmm. For... Ugh. I feel like I'm running out of stuff. Well, never fear. We actually were in the area where we're at, or where we need to be to grab stuff. Um, if we run out of, well, if we run out of pipes, that's fine. If we run out of, um, copper sheets, we're going to be in a little bit of trouble. I think we'll stop there. Not necessarily. I think maybe we'll bring it down to, like, right here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Actually, actually, let's bring it down to right here. Yes. Right there. Bingo. Okay. And then from here, let's put another entrance over here on this side. Uh, we'll connect power to... Can I create one of these? No, because I don't have any of that stuff. For a second there, I thought it was going to freeze on me. I'm <laughs> freak out. Oh, stupid autosave. Um, Alright, so six. Of course, all of these power lines are freaking full. You've got to be kidding me. I didn't leave any room for expansion on power over here? Aha! There we go. So there's that one, and then we can go into there. Hehehe. <laughs> Um, I don't know, oh god, I don't know how long it's been now. So there we go. Let's go! Let's travel! Traveling the world! <coughs> this is great. This is absolutely great. I was thinking I was gonna have to be down on the ground for this. But I don't have to be. I'm actually traveling kind of quickly, too. Well, a little quickly. I mean, it's, it's going a little slow. Problem is, is that when you go uphill, you're going slow. Downhill, you speed up a little bit. This is where it's not going to be very sightly to see, but this is so much faster. This is so much faster to get over here. Oh, there you go. Hypertube is built. Yes. That is awesome. That is totally awesome. What else did we unlock? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Logistics. Okay, we got to go back through it. <laughs> we got to go back through this thing. See, we're going a little bit faster since we went downhill right away. And now we're going to pick up even more speed going downhill this way. I mean, yeah, we slowed down going back up, but we're still going faster than what we were. So I think... I think it might be a good idea to take the exit for this. Yeah, see, we're going a little faster now. Um, oh my god, I love it! <laughs> Oh, gosh. No, we're, we're just going to leave it like it is. I like this. 
Okay, we're gonna go back. I swear, this is the last time today that we're gonna be doing this. Um, but this gives us a really good... Let's look behind us. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, foundries. See you later. We'll be back. <laughs> I know. I'm a total dork. I can't help it. Oh, but there we go. We've got the Hyperloop in here. Um, so now what I need to do is I need to go in and upgrade coal. Uh, so that we can get more of that into the system. Uh, how many... Where's my inventory here? Um, I need to go and grab... Oh no, I've got I've got a decent amount. So I should be okay with that. Um, I'm hitting the wrong buttons here. Where is... I should have... Some stuff to overclock, and I don't know what I did with it. Okay, give me all of that. Can I craft more shards? I can do two of these. I still need to do the purple one in the ma'am. Which I don't want to give it up. Power slugs. I can do it. Start research. It's the only purple one I had, so that's unfortunate, but those are done. I want to get this done. Ooh, that's ugly. That one's done, that one's done. That's kind of done. Not nearly done. Okay. I'm gonna have to work on that stuff later. Um, I have no more purple power slugs, correct? No. And no. Okay, just making sure. But I have a couple on me. I think I have like five on me. I wanted to jump. Okay, so if I'm looking at this up here, currently we're doing 120 per minute. But as you can see, we have gaps. And those gaps get even bigger when they go down there and get into this over here. Let's see if we can see it from here. You see, see those gaps all the way out there? Some pretty big ones. So we need to increase our production here. Um, of course, the only way for us to do that is to overclock it. So if I go, wow, that's 360? Seriously? Whoa, hold on, hold on. We're already at, if we're at 100%, that's 240. Oh. Oh, so that is the problem. Isn't it? Because these are only MK2 belts, which are 120. Hold on. Logistics. Yes. So really, we just need to upgrade these. Oh, that makes me so much happier. Oh my gosh, that does. That makes me a lot happier now. Okay. All right. So then let's go into... Let's get rid of that. I'm hitting the wrong buttons. Okay, so that needs to be three. And then four, five, six. Okay, so six. Upgrade that. Um... Might as well just drop down. Uh, ouch. Alright, so three. Upgrade that one. Upgrade this one. And that should give us what we need. Shouldn't have any other issues then. But that's good to know that when we throw in just one shard, that's going to up that to like 360. That's awesome. I thought I was going to have issues with coal. Oh my god, I'm so happy now. Because I'm sitting here trying to figure out how we're going to do this next step with steel pipes and everything, but I totally didn't even realize that. <laughs> you have no idea how happy I am now. Oh my gosh, wow, that's great. Okay, so then if we have this coming in here... 
like that. And that goes into there, and that's it. That's done. Um, so we need those to be a different color. Are we going to call those... Are we going to do those red, I think? So maybe... This one... We edit... There you go. Update preset. Confirm. Select color. Ah! Reload. 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 Please tell me I have more. Okay. Beautiful. That makes me so happy. Oops. Okay. Okay. Now, iron. Is iron an issue? So we have iron coming in here. See, iron is a little bit of an issue because of the way it's being split. Well, it's fine going in there. It's fine going in there. Oh, we're fine. We're totally fine. Okay. We have no problems with that whatsoever. Now this is sending out a steady stream. Beautiful. I love it. Okay. So these are sending out 60 per minute, which there's going to be a little bit of a backlog because it's like 60.3. So then these now should be going 100%. Okay, which is then putting that into here, and then the this should now be going at 100%. Now it's at 59. Well, it's at 21, 22. Okay, so 62%, so that's, okay, that's doing a lot better now. Oh my gosh, yes, please and thank you, that, <laughs> oh my god. Oh, you have no idea how happy I am. That, that, I'm loving this color too. Um, so we're going to make that one red. Oh yeah, that's a great color. It's awesome. Okay. <laughs> I know, it's the little things in life that make me so happy. It really is. Um, I'm not worried about coal anymore. I'm not worried about the iron over here anymore. We've got so many resources that are untouched right now, which is good because we are going to need them. I think that's going to be it. What? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, what else did we unlock? Oh, yeah, the MK3, which we're, we're good with. We've upgraded the belts that we needed to. Ooh, whoops. <laughs> I was not planning on doing that. That's great. And that means that we'll be able to get more coal power in here too. Let's put, no, that wrong color. It needs to be red. There you go. Okay. So that's giving me, and there's still a little bit of a backup in here too, which means we're not fully utilizing all of the resources because the belt itself is 270 items per minute. See, we're we're not using full 100% constantly with that. It's staying backed up a little bit, which I'm good with. Okay. Oh, we're going to leave it there today, to be honest with you. So questions, comments, concerns, put it in the comment section down below. Uh, you know I will get to your to the answers as quickly as I possibly can. Ouch! Did not mean for that to happen. Um... I think that's it. Yeah. So next episode, we'll work on automated wiring. And we'll go from there. So that is all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. And I'll see you next time. And yes, I'm going to go in this one more time. <laughs>